What's up everyone, welcome to my channel again. Before we start today's video, click that subscribe button so that you won't miss any future content. Also, do follow my Instagram page at the Mando Driver. I'll be doing some update on the Instagram page. And also, if you are into photography, do also follow my photography page. I, I was a phone camera photographer and I just get my new secondhand DSLR recently. So maybe not a photographer, but do check it out. And today we're going to talk about driving a car with signal on the wrong side of the steering wheel. The indicator should be located at outside of the steering. Like for a right-hand drive car, it should be located at the right side. For a left-hand drive car, left side. But then there is some car like Proton or some other European brand have a signal on the wrong side of the steering wheel. Well, for European car because they are lazy to set the switch. But for Proton, it's their design language. It makes the car pseudo-European. But the thing is, nobody likes the design. Nobody, even me. And the thing is, you can't really modify the stick to set it. All you can do is get used to it. First, you need to readjust your seat. Now just do it because it is part of the procedure. Now first, lay your body at your seat and straighten your right arm. And your wrist should be right on the steering wheel. And you can bend down. Next, put your hand on the two of the steering wheel. Don't put a tree because if you put a tree, you unconsciously flip the wiper switch. So keep your right hand at two and control the movement of the steering. And also the wiper speed. Your left hand do all the other work. Like the audio, the aircon, the gear change, and the indicator. If, if your left hand is free of work, just put it at the 10 position. And always remind yourself, don't do other work with your right hand. Don't move the right hand, don't move the right hand, don't move the right hand. Ah, uh, see? Why you move the right hand? After a few days of week, you will be used to signal at the wrong side of the steering wheel. And this is actually a good practice. Because first, your right hand is always on your steering wheel. You always have a control of your car at all times. Two, your hands are always on the correct position, which is the 2 and the 10. Next, you develop a habit of using your indicator all the time. Because if you don't use it, you can't practice it. If you have another car which has signal on the correct side of the steering wheel, don't worry, just hold the steering at the 3 and the 9, and you unconsciously flip the right lever for the signal. I hope you find this video informative and useful. If you have any other method, do comment in the comment section so that people may benefit from it. And subscribe to me if you haven't. And I'll see you in the next video.